Hi everyone and welcome to Phil's Fun Fact Friday from Team Vincent Motorsports here in Air Ontario. You know, back in the late 60s, early to 70s, there were people who had cottages and cabins with no road access, much like today. So today, people look at the Expedition, the Tundra to get in. Back in the late 60s, early 70s, the sled of choice was the Skidoo Nordic. The Nordic was the original two-up luxury cruiser that had the power and flotation to take the driver and passenger through all snow conditions. It had a wider track than the other skidoos of that era. An 18-inch track provided much better flotation than the typical 15-inch tracks of the time. Nordics were first seen in the late 60s with a 371cc engine, but that was soon boosted up to a 399, then the 440 and 640 motors were added. These luxury, go-anywhere cruisers had a few unique items. You had the electric start model, and if you had that, you also got a cigarette lighter. Did Skidoo predict the 12-volt adapter on a snowbill way back then? Hmm, interesting. This 1972 Nordic is a 440, but if you bought the 640 version, you could also opt for the reverse gear. That was a great item for the slightly heavier Skidoo Nordic. You probably noticed that this Nordic has a polycarbonate hood, similar to the Olympic, while other models of that era had fiberglass. Yes, that's right, Skidoo had polycarbonate and fiberglass at the same time. The Skidoo Nordic was the original two-up, go-anywhere luxury cruiser. Only available for a few years, but still a proud part of Skidoo history. Using a snowbill to access your cabin or cottage in the winter is a really cool experience. I've been there, done it. What a blast accessing your summer property in the winter through a totally different means. So today we've got sleds like the Tundra, the Scandic, the Expedition, sleds that can get you into your cottage. Back then, well, the Nordic was the sled of choice and what a great sled it was. We'd like to thank you for watching our video series here at Team Vincent Motorsports. Remember to like, comment, because we like to hear what you have to say about the old days as well. Team Vincent Motorsports, Air Ontario.